the graph of the line 2y plus 3x equals 7 is given right over here. Determine its x-intercept. So the x-intercept is the x value when y is equal to 0. Or it's the x value where our graph actually intersects the x-axis. Notice, notice, right over here, our y value is exactly 0. We're sitting on the x-axis. So let's think about what this x value must be. Well, just looking at it from just trying to eyeball a little bit, it looks like it's a little, it's a little over 2. It's between 2 and 3. It looks like it's less than 2 and a half. But we don't know the exact value. So let's go turn to the equation to figure out the exact value. So we essentially have to figure out what x value when y is equal to 0 will have this equation be true. So we could just say 2 times 0 plus 3x is equal to 7. Well, 2 times 0 is just going to be 0. So we have 3x is equal to 7. And then we can divide both sides by 3 to solve for x. And we get x is equal to 7 over 3. Now, does that look like 7 thirds? Well, we just have to remind ourselves that 7 over 3 is the same thing as 6 over 3 plus 1 over 3. And 6 over 3 is 2. So this is the same thing as 2 and 1 third. Another way you could think about it is 3 goes into 7 two times. And then you have a remainder of 1. So you still got to divide that 1 by 3. So it's 2 full times and then a 1 third. So this looks like 2 and 1 third. And so that's its x-intercept, 7. 7 thirds. If I was doing this on the exercise on Khan Academy, it's always a little easier to type in the improper fraction. So I would put in 7 thirds.